friends. Welcome back to my channel. This is Taisha with Organized Plans. I want to start by thanking all of my returning subscribers for spending some time with me today. And if you're new to my channel and haven't subscribed yet, I would love to have you. In today's video, I'm going to be decorating my Happy Planner Classic Vertical Catch-All Planner for the week of April 15th through the 21st. So if you'd like to join me for this plan with me, then let's get started. <music> Okay, friends, so for this week's spread, I am going to be using the Live Love Posh, Live Love Go Wild sticker book. Um, I have really been enjoying using this sticker book as part of all of my Go Wild um, set planner setup uh, videos and so forth. I do have a playlist on my channel um, where I have created a number of different insert pages for my planner uh, and a full flip through of how all that came came together. So definitely check out that video if you want to see all the different ways that I've used this sticker book. Um, but for this week's spread, there are some stickers that I've been just holding out <laughs> and waiting to use um, for this week um, because this is the week of Go Wild happening April 18th through the 21st. And as I said, I definitely have had my eye on a specific set of floral stickers that I've wanted to use. So I'll go ahead and just flip to those now. Um, it is this set here, uh, these right here, and there are just two pages. They're on uh, um, just sticker paper, and I just love these colors. This is just so, so pretty. The shades of purple and pink and orange, I think it's just such a pretty color combination. So that's what I'm gonna be using for this week. So I'm gonna start by just taking the pages off the disc. And I hope everyone is doing well and having a great day. <clears throat> I can say, um, you know, this month of April has been extremely busy. <laughs> I feel like there's so much that I still need to get done, even outside of Go Wild. Um, just, you know, different, lots of different things going on. Um, for example, um, this week on April 17th is my husband's birthday. So I've had um, four birthdays this month. My sister sister-in-law, my nephew, my, hus my husband, and then my son's birthday is next week on April 24th. So lots of birthdays, just been very busy at work um, and, um, and everything. So why don't we go ahead and get jumped in and start with planning. I'm just going to write out that little note and then this quote at the bottom just to give me kind of a clean slate of everything. And so I do have my wax paper here. Just wanna grab that um, as well. And I hope everyone out there is doing well. And I just wanna thank everyone for all your continued support of my channel. I so appreciate all of just the comments and feedback and you know likes and subscribing um, and everything. And um, I know I've heard from um, different viewers that you've enjoyed this Go Wild series that I had going on on my channel and I definitely do plan on um, trying to uh, do some filming while I'm at Go Wild just so I can do a little bit of vlogging and share that um, when I return back. So definitely stay on the lookout, you know, for any additional content. Um, but now it is getting to the final uh, countdown of everything. And these florals are just so, so pretty. So I've got a lot of great options here. I think I want to pull in this one as well. And I'm going to need some function for sure. Um, so what's nice is this Live Love Posh sticker book has um, a lot of uh, functional boxes and bullet points and all that in here too. So I'm hopeful I can use this one sticker book for everything. So let me just kind of move things around a little bit just so I can now pull <clears throat> my functional 
pieces. So I think I will go, I was just looking at these ones that kind of have this ombre effect. Um, that could actually work. Um, that could be an option. Now let's go to the bigger boxes. So I have the pink, and a couple shades of pink. And I wanna grab some of this purple as well. Really like this purple. Maybe I'll stick with mostly the purple. This book is also has some checklists in it, which I can use. Okay, I think I've got purple and pink. All right. <clears throat> so let me just grab this box as well. And then some of the checklists. Maybe a purple and a pink. Okay. And maybe a couple of the header boxes as well. I think will work. I'll go with like this lighter pink. Okie dokie. All right, so that looks great. And then I did also, I had a couple of stickers left over. These I printed from, um, I found a font on defont.com that was like a Western style. And I uh, downloaded it to my Cricut designer software, typed up the words I wanted to use and then print it on some clear sticker paper and then cut it um, on my Cricut. So I wanna just use a couple of like the Go Wild and, and Dallas, Texas sticker book, um, uh, letters as well, or a uh, word. So, okay, so I think, I think I've got enough to get started. So, um, I think this one would go well down in this corner. So let's start over here. And just, I'm gonna just put this right into that corner. Okay. So I think I'll do a piece. Could go like that or down the side. Um, I think I like the look down the side. That would be really pretty. So let's put that here. Okay. And then I'm gonna put this piece across the top. That's pretty. I think this piece here as well. Oh, I just love these like big bold florals. They are so pretty and it's easy because it is on paper. So um, clear sticker paper rather. So I don't have to white out anything underneath. Okay, so I want to, let's get maybe a box here on Monday. 
up here. Okay. And I know I want a box for Wednesday. For my husband's birthday. I think it would be good to have a checklist maybe here like checking in for my flight um, things like that to finish up with on on Wednesday I'm gonna grab another box I go back to that pink one I pulled um, I really want this side of the page to give me a lot of function so I'm just going to put maybe this box here and some bullet points. I think I'll go with the color purple and I'll do two here and then another two. Just grab this. here. Okay. That box is a little crooked, so I will have to come back and fix that. Okay, and now over on to the right side of the page. Um, so, I think I want to bring in another large floral. And I'm just gonna kind of make that into a bit more of a right angle. the top right at that edge okay and I'm gonna bring in my go wild stickers the box on Sunday for when I get back of just things I need to do on Sunday afternoon right up at that top line that's a better placement for it and I did get a little bit of a bubble and so let me just fix that Dallas, Texas. I think I can fit that right on this line as well. I did a pretty large offset going around 
this sticker so I can really kind of cut off some of that plastic. Um, okay, so, and I'm gonna put that right on this bottom line. Okay, love that. Very happy with that. And I think I'll put this piece here. And I'll just have a couple of holes to punch. And then I want to also get in this one. Okay, and I'm just going to do another like header here, header box, and then maybe a pink box here, just a little bit. Okay, all right, that works pretty, so I've got all the purple, the lighter pink, the darker pink. I love it. So the final touch that I want to do is I have this um, washi and I have like very <laughs> little of it remaining. So I want to have to try to use this sparingly, but it is like a cheetah print and it's like an ombre effect. So I just want to bring in um, this washi into this red and just use it here and there. Or maybe I'll put this piece to this side. Okay. And another little piece here. And it's got like the purple, the orangey color. Um, okay, let me see if I can get a little bit more off this roll. Okay, so I'm gonna put a piece here. And a piece at the top and the bottom. And that is like the end of the roll. Uh, it definitely like got every little bit out of it that I could. All right, super cute. Okay. Uh, that is so pretty. Just like the perfect little finishing touch, I think. Um, so I think this is a great like functional spread for me, especially for the beginning of the week, uh, for all the final things to get done. Again, celebrating my husband's birthday. And then, uh, you know, when I get back on Sunday uh, and just, you know, things I have to do on Sunday when I return. So I really love how this spread came together. I love these florals so much. So you'll definitely have to let me know what you think down in the comments below and if you like this video don't forget to click the like button and give me a big thumbs up would greatly appreciate you subscribing i thank you all so much for watching and i hope you have a great day bye friends